Celebrating a very special birthday today with our parent company, Disney. 50 years ago, the famous song and attraction, It's a Small World, was born here at the World's Fair in New York. And Sarah Haynes went to Orlando to see how It's a Small World is, how it's doing after a half century. It's the song the whole world seems to love. And the smile means friendship to everyone. Though the mountains divide, it's a small, small world. <laughs> With the words we can't seem to forget. Debe haber más. In any language, in every corner of the world. It's the theme song for the extraordinary boat ride at Disney parks around the world. On any given day, at any given moment, the song is playing somewhere in the world. To all who come to this happy place, welcome. Millions go to their happy place when they visit, like five-year-old Luke from Wisconsin. I loved it. You loved it? Yeah, it was so magical. Magical exactly what Walt Disney intended. It's the most unique musical timepiece ever created. The attraction premiered at the World's Fair in New York in 1964. Two years later, at Disneyland, Walt Disney and an international group of children christened the ride with water from every ocean. What was Walt Disney's vision for It's a Small World? It's its universal message of peace and hope and unity around the world. With almost 300 dolls that animate robotically, it is an attraction of art, precision, and beauty. I sailed through the world that I too once visited as a child. I also got a sneak peek behind the scenes, the control room that dispatches the boats. And backstage, the doll's dressing room. There's over 5,000 costume pieces in that attraction. That includes all the jewelry, the hats, the socks and shoes, and we make all of that in this room. Walt Disney's vision of peace and joy in our small world still striking the same universal chord it did 50 years ago. It's a small The big moment has arrived. We have choirs all around the world ready to sing along with us. First, though, we're going to kick things off right here in Times Square with the wonderful Young People's Chorus of New York City. So let's take it away. It's a world of laughter, a world of tears. It's a world of
Good morning, America, from the International Space Station. It really is a small, small world. Wow, so you can see our sing-along wasn't just global. Strachio, who's a veteran of three space shuttle missions. He's been aboard the International Space Station since November 2013. Thank you, Rick. And thank you to the Young People's the Chorus. Continue. I yeah. mean, wow. it is a small world after yeah. all, right? Thank you. You guys sounded perfect. I want to thank everybody who took part in this. It was really amazing. It came to life because of you. And you can go to goodmorningamerica.com on Yahoo to find out more about how you can help celebrate It's a Small World by uploading your version of the song. Yes.